Hi, I'm Daniel Smith and I'm here with Jonathan Fox. We're going to look at the uh, new HDS 7, third generation, and we want to show you what we've got in the box. Okay, open the box. We've got um, Navionics maps. This is the Platinum Plus 3D edition. Um, got a box here. This is the structure scanner. Um, we'll cover that. Um, as we get to fitting that later. We've got the transducer, that's going to work with the structure scanner. And we've got the HD7 Gen 3 from Lawrence. Okay, so let's open the box and see what we've got in here. Right, so that's the unit. Show you that quickly. It's got a screen cover on it. I'll put that to one side. Underneath here, we've got the mounting bracket, a bunch of wires, um, and a fuse and some fixings. And that's it. Right, okay, so we'll take the cover off. It's probably easier when it's mounted. There we go, and there's the unit. On the back, got a whole load of um, plugs there, ethernet, radio, sonar, structure, and power. Um, and we'll get to finding out what they all do when we install it. When you're installing this Lowrance HDS7, please read the manual before you start the installation. Otherwise you're going to be confused. <laughs> <laughs> confused as a puppy sitting next to a pile of poo. <laughs> The lip that was there. Well, the lip's there. Right, and where are you so going? I could have either gone there. Yeah, well, I think it needs to go higher than that. It's when that's flat in the water, it's supposed to be within. Well, the it shows you there, best mounting location sort of starts at the height of this. Right. Or this, which is quite low, Ooh. and goes across to like here, really. So I think if we're Perhaps somewhere there yeah. and somewhere there with the other? Yeah, I agree. Yeah, I agree. All I'm saying is the bottom of the actual thing needs to be in line with that because if Here. it's slightly higher, yeah. then you're going to get an air void. Oh. This, all this area doesn't get any of the water when right, you're moving okay. at speed. So does it matter if it goes lower slightly? Is that what you're thinking? So it, it needs, needs to be... be no... Because that's why if I'm thinking if we've got a flat there, we go with that flat and we know we're... Do you know what I mean? Yeah, I agree. That's what I'm saying. So you just, we, all you got to do is be careful when that's flat in the water because it's not be it won't sit down like that. No. That there, that lip needs to be in the same level as that. Does it matter if it's higher or lower by yeah, anything? Yeah, it does. Yeah, you're way too low. And if it's if it's on an angle, it's supposed yeah. to be half and half. So I would say you're about right there. Do you reckon? Yeah, I do. Yeah. Okay. So middle of the old. Pretty much it, isn't it? And it's got to be within a foot, is it? Within. You yeah. see, that's definitely within um, the water line because yeah. you're going to be under this. So. Yeah, well, you can yeah. see it. And so. Yeah, it's just got to be within, out of um, the eye of that, which it is. So yeah, I'd say anywhere there, mate. 